remixes. What better way to honor a beloved piece of music than saying, Hey everyone, you know that one song? I could do it way better! Nowadays, video games have some high-class names like Clint Mansell and Danny Elfman working for the EAs and the Lionheads, but you, yes you, the common fans, are the real heart of the video game music industry. Well, maybe not the heart, more like the lungs, but anyway. My point is that we all know about the professional remixes, but we often ride on past the minivan of independent effort lying on the side of the road of musical merit with the flat tire of unappreciation and the walls of obscurity are closing in and they just need some attention! Well, I'm gonna give it to them. We're recognizing the top 10 independent remixes for video game music. Now I've got a few rules for this little doohickey, so listen up all the alls. First off, only one song per franchise and per composer to keep things competitive. Secondly, the song must be an improvement on the original and be able to work within the context of the game it was first used in. In other words, you could replace the original with the remix and the experience of the game would be improved. Third, the song cannot be connected to the original composers or companies. It has to be a completely unaffiliated fan composition. So play fair, everyone. It's time for me to shut up and for you to listen to the top 10 independent remixes for video games. 10, 9, Yikes. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1.